Hey, what's up everybody? I'm going for a dive and this is the first sunny day that I've been diving at for a long time. But I'm going to preface this video by saying I'm not going to land any fish on this on this uh, day. But um, I was thinking of not posting anything, but um, I wanted to document what is happening with my diving. So I'm... I got my uh, hammerhead mask working perfectly but what I think is happening to me is uh, my vision is getting uh, worse and worse and there's something about this mask it's really kind of throwing me off it's taking me um, a little bit um, to uh, focus uh, once I hit the bottom so I'm out here and I'm going to swim north. Um, there are a whole bu bunch of humu humu ele ele. I'm just taking a little warm up drop in the shallows, try to see if I can get them on film. Don't plan on shooting. And right at this moment here, when I start to look up, I have a real hard time focusing. So it, it's kind of throwing me off and I. Th what I can um, see is happening is, uh, and you'll see it when I start taking some shots. I think I'm aiming, what looks to be dead center is going high for me. So um, I think maybe next week, you know, if I'm, if I'm going to three prong, uh, I think I'm going to uh, maybe try, uh, go back to my old mask, my cheap mask. Uh, there's some nai down there, so I'm going to make a drop with my Evolve 3 prong. So one other thing is, uh, there's some controversy that sees in the comments. Like every time I used to use a 3 prong, the prongs are th spread out. And I did one like that, and then I got a lot of feedback saying, no, don't spread out the prongs. Because when you hit them, um, the prongs will spread out. What do you guys think? So here, like, as I'm trying to focus, my fin hit 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 the um hit the coral head, so that's what spooked them. And there, you see, like, I'm up and to the left when in that munu came in, and it looks pretty straight on to me. So I'm not sure what it is. You know, I'm not blaming the mask. Don't don't get me wrong. It's not the mask. It's something to do with my vision. And I think, as I spoke when I first started trying out the hammerhead mask, is it feels super good. I mean, it feels really good. I don't get mask squeeze, but I think it's because the glass is so close. It's you know because it's much lower volume than my my cheapo Amazon mask. Um, the glass is closer to my face, and you know my my left eye is the one that's really beat up so it's kind of kind of throwing me off but we'll see so I've kept trying to use it because you know I'm trying to adjust it because I wanted to um, I wanted to make it work because it feels so comfortable I'm going there's some more in the I down here and I'm crawling over and he's right there and I should have should have shot but again I'm having a hard time lining up distance was way long but you can see I nicked it and and where is it it's up up and on the back you can see it right there I was gonna see if I can kind of get it because I was wondering in case it was um you know wounded more than it was I, I think that guy's gonna survive so what is that that's two misses so far and um, the other thing that's kind of happening is when I hit the bottom, and I'm diving super shallow today, and I'm working on my uh, duck dive entry, which is, um, uh, I was pretty happy with my entry. It was, it was pretty silent. But uh, the other thing that happens when I look up is sometimes right there, what happened was bubbles escape my mask. And that's what spooked the moon. And I was going like, what the heck just happened? 
So I still have plenty of air, so I reloaded. The King Kole and the Nai Nai were still hanging around. So just kind of trying to relax as King Kole comes in. And I thought I got it, but look where I hit it again. It's high. Now, now that I watched the video, I mean, I, you know, I think I should have made adjustments more, but, you know, it, it's really kind of hard to see something like, oh, I'm hitting it center and then adjust lower, you know, because, um, you know, usually, like, if I'm seeing the center uh, or, like, the headshot, then, you know, the spear pretty much goes there, so... It was just one of those things. So I really hate wounding fish. And I'm getting kind of bummed out here. There's some Mykoikos here. Mm -hmm. King Kole there. And I haven't got a Mykoiko in a long time. There again. Take another shot on the King Kole and that was right above it getting really frustrated at this point but you know I'm trying to not let the frustration get get to me and just keep working and you know you, you gotta have fun so I thought I'd go in a little bit more shallow and this is pretty much my last drop of the day And if you haven't tried the Mykoiko, you don't know what you're missing. It is so delicious. Uh, it fries up just like a kole. And it has this little orange sack. I guess it's intestines and stuff are more orange in color. And it's, it's pretty delicious. There again, shot, miss, wounded a fish, so bummed. So that's pretty much it. I just wounded too many fish today. Didn't land anything, so I just decided to call it quits. So I headed in. And it was super calm. Really easy to get in. So I'm just going to glide on the rocks. Pull myself up. Let the waves push me on. And I made it back. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and aloha.